News now from Andhra Pradesh and the no confidence motion moved against the Congress government in the assembly will come up for voting today. It was moved by Chandra Babu Naidu over the issue of farmer suicides. Though Chief Minister Kiran Kumar Reddy had sounded confident that his government was safe. There was last minute apprehension over how MLAs who were voted in on Chiranjeevi's Prajarajam party would vote. Also a worry about how many Congress MLAs who were supporting Jagan Mohan Reddy would vote during this trust vote in the assembly. Well, let's go across to Uma Sudhir now for more uh, UMA uh, discussions and debates on uh, in the assembly now and the Congress does seem safe. Yes, Gargi, we are uh, at the Andhra Pradesh Assembly and inside the debate is going on on the farmers issue. Chandra Babu Naidu uh, had moved this motion on the farmers issue considering that more than 100 farmers have committed suicide in Andhra Pradesh in the last uh, two and a half months. But as you mentioned, yes, non-farmer politics is what is seeming to be played out here in Andhra Pradesh. Last minute, the Praja Rajim party, which has merged with the Congress but is technically still a separate party in the Andhra Pradesh Assembly, they had expressed their displeasure over the way they were treated by the Congress and they had to be reassured by Gulam Nabi Azad and and phone calls from Ahmed Patel to tell them that they would be taken care of and they should be voting in favor of the government. So uh, now the Congress does seem safe, but in a sense, it's really a real test for Jagan Mohan Reddy, who had challenged in Delhi that uh, he had thrown an open challenge saying that it is on his mercy and his party's mercy that the Congress government in Andhra Pradesh is uh, surviving. So in a sense, it is being seen as a litmus test for the strength of the YSR Congress. A uh, short while ago, Vijayama, who is the lone Congress uh, MLA in the Andhra Pradesh Assembly and of Jagan Mohan Reddy, she came along with a band of 18 MLAs who claimed to be her supporters from various parties, including the Prajarajim and the Congress. Whether they will really vote against the whip issued by their parties, that remains a big question, which really would mean they face this for qualification and by elections. Whether their parties and these individual MLAs are ready for that, that's what is uh, waiting to be really seen. So, uh, Congress may sail through, but the numbers could hold the real surprise. Gargi. Right, Uma, thanks so much for joining us uh, with.